Superflex system. Do-it-yourself lure making made extremely easy. Producing professional lures like these is a simple and cost-effective procedure. And you have a large range of moulds available to you for both sea and freshwater fishing. The colour range is endless, really down to your own imagination. Or you can create top catching colours like this rhubarb and custard, pearl white fire tails, now the popular bubblegum pink, and you have a variety of sizes to select from to cover a wide range of fishing inshore, offshore, wrecking quite extensive do they catch fish you ask? this catch footage was shot recently during extensive testing of a range of the lures made from the moulds that are now available to you in the Superflex system the lures as you can see caught a range of quality fish and they also proved to be very durable. This video is part one of a series to introduce and guide you through making a range of lures to suit both your needs and your fishing requirements. As you will find as you work through the program it's a very very simple system and produces quality lures at very cost effective prices. So your starter kit has arrived along with the lure moulds that you've chosen and the colours that you want to make. Before we start let's do some safety first. Basic handling of any form of chemicals. The Superflex liquid is silicon rubber and it's quite safe but don't try eating it. The catalyst is flammable so no smoking or naked flames and it is harmful if swallowed so handle with care and store all items away from children. The cap on the bottle itself is the child proof push down type so you have to push it down, turn it to actually undo it. So that is quite safe but still keep it stored away in a safe area. The catalyst is applied to the silicon using a syringe. This allows you to easily measure the exact quantity you need to activate the Superflex silicon. As a safety precaution we recommend that you wear safety glasses and the reason is when you press the syringe the catalyst itself can come out at quite a pressure and it can splash back and you certainly don't want that in your eyes. If you don't have safety glasses we'll show you another alternative safe measure to stop you getting splashed back. The standard starter kit is self explanatory but I'll run through the contents with you. Superflex part A is the silicon. Mixed proportions are on the label Technical support, visit the website or drop us an email. Part B is the catalyst. Again, mixed proportions are on the label. You have a set of paper cups for mixing, timber spatulas, syringe we've already covered, mould release oil, and a soft brush for applying it. And you also have the plastic scrapers, set of those, three different sizes, used for cleaning off the mould tops. We haven't supplied you with colours, because obviously the reins that are available, you need to select the ones that suit the lures that you want to make. Similar, choosing your mould, we haven't included a standard one. Probably if we did, it would be one that you didn't want anyway. So best to visit the website and purchase the ones that are going to be exactly what you need. The range of moulds I produce for the Superflex silicon system is extensive and it's growing all the time. 
Molds themselves are made in high impact polyurethane resin and they are very very tough. Interior surfaces give good high definition moulds and that reflects in the finished lure that you're making. Good high definition. Moulds themselves are suitable for both cold cure and hot cure systems like plastisol if you prefer to use a material like that. Comes complete with jig heads, facility or you can make just a body or there are designs of body only if you prefer to use that style of lure. Very low maintenance, all you've got to do is just wash them in hot soapy water when you're finished with them. Remove any silicon and mould release oil, otherwise that will go tacky and then just store them away. They come complete with rubber feet, stop you chasing it all around your work surface. New designs are being added all the time, visit the website, you've got plenty to choose from. You'll find there's ones with just the single cavities and moulds with more than one cavity. Good range of designs as you can see some of the lures they produce here. Very extensive system growing all the time. Facilities for building in the jig heads like I say that's available in some of the moulds and we'll show you how to reinforce them later on in the movie using a wire framework stop it tearing out and that produces good solid lures very very durable withstand all the bites, takes cod, pollock, bass etc don't twist good thing about the moulds themselves and the lures very easy to produce that gets torn up cut the jig head out come back make some more it's that easy that quick as you're going to see You'll find in the store a range of ancillary items that you can purchase. For example, plastic beakers. Quite like using these because you can actually see the contents and when you mix in, you can see that the whole area and the silicon has been mixed together. Ideal size. Suits so up to 100 millilitres. Silicon oil. If you want to play with the silicon itself and soften it down, silicon oil is ideal. Gives you all the proportions on the bottle. Again, technical support if you need it. Worth thinking about when you're doing some of the smaller lures and you want to make the tail a little bit softer and a bit more attractive. Safety glasses we've already covered. Syringes. This is modelling clay. Ideal for holding jig heads into the actual aperture of the jig head uh, mould itself. Very simple to use, doesn't break down, it's not gluey, works ideal, holds it in place beautifully and I'll show you that shortly. Range of jig heads, different sizes, bullet, ball, all with eagle claw hooks. It's the only hooks that I use now, very strong, hard wire 570s. Aluminium wire, that comes in a coil, very soft, very easy to apply, provides a nice strong fixing and when that tag, that loop grips into the silicon, it's very difficult to pull that out. I have a range of eyes, 3D eyes, different sizes, different colours, up to 10 millimetres. Used for a little gadget, it's a lure level. Ideal for checking the level of the table, worktop, making sure your level is correct on the mould and everything so you don't get a slop over because the silicon will find its own level and it will start to run out if it's dreadfully out of level. Colours, as you can see, you've got quite a range to select from. That particular package will create virtually every colour that you're likely to need for lures. Two sizes, 21 millilitre and a 37 milliliter tube and they will last a long time because you need very little the silicon accepts color very very well obviously silicon that's available in 500 grams or one kilo bottles so you need additional supplies you can order that similar catalyst that comes complete with the uh, 
silicon but if you need extra catalyst because you've overused it you can buy that separately mold release oil it's a vegetable type oil one that we've uh, sourced works absolutely superb very cheap to buy and again lasts a long time glitters and flakes so if you want to bling your lures up ideal these work well different colors blues golds silvers more brushes if you need more brushes again they last a long time grip seal bags ideal for keeping your lures in protects them and when you store them away it's easy to see exactly what you've made and what you've got in stock super glue the one that we sourced and we, we went for this particular brand because it's high viscosity ideal when you're gluing eyes in or when you're tacking down the aluminium reinforcing wire on the hooks works superb doesn't run everywhere you've got around 15 to 20 seconds movement time so you have got a little bit of time to actually just reposition uh, the items that you're trying to glue together and then it will take very very strong so you've got quite a range there to pick from of additional items uh, and backup um, materials when you want to uh, top up your supplies just pop along to the website and you'll see those there and any information that you need just drop us an email <laughs>